Hello. What's up, guys? This is your pet shine. <laughs> Welcome back. And yep, like I said, that I'll be always uh not always. I mean, I'll be doing different type of videos starting from now, which is like now. I'm just like gonna sit down and talk because seriously, I think that sitting down and talking to you guys is the most better way to like communicate, you know. And if you think you wanna skip some part, just skip lah. Because I won't be editing this 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 video because it's like I don't have my editing software. My editing software is like shit. So yeah. So today, what are we gonna talk about? How to motivate yourself. Hey, let me just tell you guys something. Ah, seriously, a lot, a lot of people, a lot of people have been losing motivation. I don't understand why, you know. I seriously don't understand why. Somehow, motivation was supposed to be a part of life, but then instead of motivation, people put depression as part of life. <laughs> Recently, a Korean act is it a Korean actress or a singer? I don't know what's the name. A Suli or something. Someone, uh, not someone. It was in the news. It said that she suicide, something. You know what? This is all my videos gonna be about. Not today, not today, but from from this onwards, it's all about this. Okay, so today, what I wanna say, what I wanna talk about is how to motivate yourself. How to motivate yourself. The first thing first, I wanna say, how I motivate myself. The first thing I do is sleep. I'm serious. Sleep. I'm serious, you know, because. You see, ah, uh, if you if you keep putting all the problems in your head and then think about it at uh what overnight and then never sleep until two o'clock, three o'clock, then uh, you get the what in insomnia, insomnia, insomnia. I don't know how you call it lah, but seriously, the best way is to sleep away your problems first. Just sleep away, sleep, sleep. Just at the point where you really think that you can't take all your problems in you already, you really feel so stressed out. Straight go to sleep. That is what I'm saying. I tell you, it helped me. I'm sure it will help you. I'm not so sure. Maybe it might. But sleeping is the first best thing that you can do. What whatever problem you face. Second. The second one is actually what I do is always write down your problems. Ah, yeah. Always write down your problems. You see, ah, because. One one logic thing only. One logic thing. If you if you keep thinking all the problems in your head, like you know, uh, oh my god, ah, uh, how is it gonna be today? What will people think about me? And you know, all whatever problems you face, like whatever problems you face, if you keep putting it inside your head, ah, uh, I am telling you, that is more stressful than ever. Whatever you do, okay, seriously, because putting all your problems in your head is like uh, how to say. Um, putting all your problems into a cage and not letting it out. That's why I say always. Whenever you have a problem, take out a piece of paper and write it down before you forget what the problem is. Because the smallest problem you think you just you just like ah yeah this is just a small problem lah. Then you keep thinking and thinking and thinking. Somehow it builds up, builds up. Somehow it build up as a. How do I say? Somehow it build build a wall. <laughs> Somehow it builds up like a like a big big problem in your head, and then you you will be like, what what the what the what the shit? Why am I even why am I even stressed about? Why 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 is this problem such a big deal? Why is this problem such a big deal? You think and think and think, until you write it down. Right, that's when you realize that actually the problem is so small. So that's why I say. Always write down your problems because writing down your problems somehow releases your mind and you get to focus on other things. And these problems of yours is right in front of your eyes, so you'll be like, "Oh, so this is my problem. Now I need to find the answer for this." So please take out a piece of paper, take out a pen, just write only. It's not, it's not a big, you know. It doesn't takes you a, a much. It doesn't takes you so much time. It's just a bit of time, and you. What the shit am I even talking about? Another way, another way to like motivate yourself is that talk to yourself more, lah. Talk to yourself seriously. 
that is what usually I do I always like you know lock lock my room and then like go to the mirror and then just talk to myself or imagine that I'm talking to someone you know because when you really talk to yourself somehow you get motivation in you you know I'm serious you see ah every single time you want to go talk to someone someone comes against you and then you don't feel motivated at all if you feel that you can't find someone i'm telling you talking to yourself is actually a best solution honestly i feel that you should talk to yourself first then go find someone because you see ah uh, depression is also given is actually right depression is not in us we create the stress we create the depression you see if we don't take other people as a big matter we don't we don't even care you know we we wouldn't even get the stress or depression or anything but the main reason why we get depression the main reason why we get stress is because we give so much effort we give so much deal about others about what they are thinking about us or uh, and then we let them affect our life what nonsense uh, it's not nonsense it's not nonsense but it's it's a bit sad it's a bit sad how we are so capable of so many things and you just let another person destroy your life when you can give yourself depression then why can't you give yourself motivation you tell me give yourself the motivation you know how just go talk to yourself you want to cry you cry you want to sit down you want to sleep just do whatever you want you know make yourself talk to yourself because talking to yourself somehow releases the stress and it gives you more confidence it builds up more confidence in you trust me that is that is what i always do whenever i feel really, really like sad or depressed or something because talking to yourself is you facing you so you you will make sure you want to go on the right track like today if i'm going to talk to myself roshni uh sorry padma today we have to make sure that our day goes good we must make sure nobody affect my life all right high five high five with yourself ah see <laughs> guys i just want to say one thing la like, is life is too short to give too much big deal about others you know and then take things too serious i get it you you want to find money okay fine you want to find money fine you you want to study hard okay fine but don't let it affect you your mental health your physical phy, uh, physical pula, physical health you know don't let it affect you because you matter so much to so many people okay especially like your mom and dad and somehow when you get stressed when you get depressed right you will um you will actually try to distance yourself from others you know and that is the most saddest thing you know I I have went through this before and then you know you you show your anger towards your loved ones more you know because you feel comfortable around them you you feel comfortable around them then you will be like you know you straight away shout to them when you're angry you you just feel like you don't like them it's all because of this stress and depression oh my god it's it's just too much even today i'm here maybe this might not help you but i hope it helps you even in the slightest way you know in the slightest way <laughs> even in the little way you know i hope it helps you because i see a lot of people are just going through these emotions man it's emotions man but these emotions are too strong and it's so sad how humans can you know humans can uh how do I say? I control the emotions, but it's okay. So that's the end. And like I said, number one, write down your problems. Oh no no no! Number one is sleep. Fucking sleep, sleep, <laughs> sleep. Because sleeping is like the best cure, best cure for me. It was the best cure. Then for you, I you must see lah. You you must try out. Okay, seriously. Number two, the next day when you wake up, write down your problems because by writing down your problems, you get to know what problems you have. In your head, you think that you have hundreds of problems. When you write, you only see like there's only two or three problem. 
the last but not least talk to yourself talk to yourself because that's only you can give motivation to yourself when you can give give yourself stress and depression then why 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 not motivation don't we oh one more thing if you really find a good friend a trustworthy friend or a counselor go talk to them if you feel you need to talk to them go and talk to them easy peasy lemon squeezy it's not easy it's not easy yes it's not easy i just say that because of the flow stupid me but talking to someone that you really trust you know lifts off the weight out of your shoulder mate that's all i want to say so this is your pet shine and i'll see you again maybe tomorrow maybe next week but not next month hell nah hell nah uh-uh <laughs> all right Bye.